Hey guys, today we're going to be taking a look at the WWE Elite Series 50 Rhino. I'm so happy to finally get to review this figure because I've been waiting a while. Um, and I have a few more wrestling wrestling, wrestling figures to review, so uh, subscribe to see all that. But, uh, first time in the line, pretty happy about that, and we're finally getting that belt, because we need that belt. Uh, they're also making Heath Slater with the other half of that belt, so, yes. I think it's series, I want to say 53 or 4. For most likely 53, but anyway, you get on the side of the package, you can see Rhino there, SmackDown Live, which I think is inaccurate now. He might be in, uh, he might be in Raw now. I don't remember, but here's all the information there. I'm kind of surprised to put ECW champion, but uh, we need a hardcore champion, even though I think they already did make it with uh, Terry Funk. But, I, I, I gotta get my hands on that figure. Um, Gore, let's be real. I, if I'm thinking it's the move I'm thinking of, it's the Spear. I mean, but, uh, there's all the other figures in this wave. I have reviewed these three. Oh, I actually reviewed John Cena, but I do have him. And, uh, I see Stephanie, like, everywhere. But I'm, I'm always putting her off just because it doesn't really look like her. I don't like the pouty face. So I'm debating on getting her. And I don't know who he is, so I'm not getting him. Uh, there's Rhino again. Anyways, let's, let's just get this guy opened up and see how cool he really okay, is. Okay, we got Rhino out of the packaging. And man. Oh, it's so wrong. Oh, it's, oh no. Oh, no. Ugh. Look at the arms. Ew. <laughs> Look how wide they are. That, that no, that's not a person. That's a fucking monster. Jesus Christ. Oh, you can't push it down. You, oh my God. Oh man. Oh, I I I sincerely hope Mattel will remake this a Rhino figure real soon in, in Elite. For him because this just is awful. <laughs> just the shoulders are really throwing me off. The, like everything else about this figure is okay. Uh, it's a little inaccurate in my opinion, but oh, look at that. Let's look at the one accessory. Actually, a couple of accessories. Um, he comes with the background thing. Again, not the biggest fan of these, but you get the weight. It's there, Series 50. So, but he also comes with uh, this belt, which I like because it's more pliable. But it's, it, I'm, I'm afraid the plates are going to come off. That's my only fear. Come on, focus. But I love the design, the, the sculpt. If you kind of like squint, it kind of looks like the cruiserweight belt, but oh god, oh my god, what is that? Is that, is that a Bigfoot? No, Bigfoot's slimmer than that. <laughs> but yeah, this yeah, this is nice. I I like this. It's very uh flimsy though, so that's that's my only gripe. I'll show it a little bit more firm. Uh, and it's quite simple. I mean, you can't get it around him, but it's kind of a pain to actually get it to buckle. So, it, it, it can, but... It's, just, it's a little bit of a pain. Yeah, come on. There you go. But, mm, oh boy, the face game looks alright, um, it, 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 it could be better, but it looks fine, like the hair, does the hair hinder articulation, not really, 
very pliable. Red splotch right there. But I do like the the attire. You can see the web there. Looks pretty good. You can see the skull. You can see the star on his elbow, but when you do that it kinda separates, so get the wrist wraps. Get the webs. What I like to call prison tattoos. <laughs> Uh, and you get gore, gore tour. Can't really get the this to line up to look. I, mean, I guess that kind of works, but uh, this, I feel like this shares the same body mold as uh, Big Biggie, but the more I, the more I'm holding him, like posing him, moving the articulation. Just doesn't feel like it. I don't know what that says. Kanye? I don't know. But I think the legs are definitely big, biggy. But articulation, the head is on a ball joint. But it's very. Doesn't, doesn't really look up or down because of the hair, but you can't look side to side. There's a slight head pivot. The arm uh, can move out all the way. Uh, Come on! I'm afraid I'm gonna break it. And the, you can move it around. There's a bicep swivel, single bend at the elbow, swivel with the hand and hinge, ab crunch that far forward, that far back, waist swivel, hip joints move out that far, thigh cut. You can kick out a little bit, back a little bit, thigh cut, boot rotation, and the feet can't hinge, but it's that weird hinge thing. So, it's kind of difficult. I'm sure if you take a hair dryer to it, it'll, it'll look good, but it'll work good. But yeah, man, this guy. Uh, I, I this comparison doesn't really make sense, but I'm making a joke with it as well, so it's okay. Uh, we got Biggie here. Um, yeah, I don't think the legs are the same, to be honest. Uh, I'm trying to find something that looks similar, but I just can't. Okay, yeah, the muscle. Yeah, definitely the same leg then. You can see the muscle. The, the boots are definitely not... I have an older Big E figure, but I didn't bring them because I wanted to keep it updated. So I think the older one has this boot. these boots. Or, I don't know. I'll, I'll let you guys know in the next wrestling video. But, yeah. I felt the arms, I think, are Mark Henry's arms, and I don't have a Mark Henry figure. I used to, but I lost it when I was, like, little. Oh, I didn't make the joke. Uh, yeah, this guy is very outdated because, uh, well, let me just take this away from you and just, there you go. Although, technically, he didn't really earn it, but still, he's still considered him one of the three of the two tag guys but anyways hope you guys enjoyed this video if you like this video please give it a thumbs up leave a comment down below and subscribe you see so much more content and i'll see you guys in the next video peace thanks for watching